हेलो एवरीवन वेलकम टू मे जोलजी ट्यूटोरियल्स बाय रेवति इन आवर लास्ट वीडियो वी डिस्कस्ड अबाउट पैलेट नाउ इन दिस वीडियो वी आर गोइंग टू डिस्कस अबाउट द टंग ऑलरेडी मन पालेट चपेटा सो द रूफ आफ द बकल कैविटी ईज आक्युपाइड बै द पालेट अना अलगे द बेस आफ द बकल कैविटी ईज आक्युपाइड बै टंग सो द फ्लोर आफ बकल कैविटी मस्क्युलर सेंसरी ऑर्गन सेंसरी ऑर्गन क्रेवन इट इज फ्रीली मूवेबल वी कैन फ्रीली मूव अ टंग एंड इट इज मस्क्युलर मीन इट इज मेड अप ऑफ स्केलेटल मसल ओके स्केलेटल मसल मीन्स इट इज वॉलेंटरी इट इज वॉलेंटरी ओके अंत कदा मन टंग मूवेंट मन कंट्रोल उदा सो इट इज मेडअप ऑफ विच मसल स्कैलेटल मसल सो द फंशन इज वॉलेंटरी एंड इट इज रेस्पल फर् विच से दट इज नथिंग बट टेस्ट इट इज रेस्पल फर् टेस्ट अंत मन टंग पैन ए रिसेप्टर्स उ रिसेप्टर्स विच रिसेव सेस्ट वाटाटो रिसेप्टर्स ए रिसेप्टर्स गैसटाटो रिसेप्टर्स ई हॉप यू अंडरस्टा ओके सो टंग इज फ्रीली मोबल इट कैन मूव फ्रीली एंड मस्क्युलर दट मीन इट इज मेडअप ऑफ स्कैलेटल मसल so that's what our tongue is voluntary and it is a sensory organ it is responsible for sense of taste that means it has which receptors gastrocnemius yes, receptors the anterior end of the tongue is in the posterior end is attached to hyoid bone attaches to hyoid bone सो मन चूस मन आंटीरियर एंड ऑफ द टंग अनेट इज फ्री दट मीन द टिप ऑफ द टंग इज फ्री वेर एज द पोस्टीरियर एंड ऑफ टंग इज अटैच हियर सो दिस इज नथिंग बट हाइड बोन द बेस ऑफ द टंग ओके आलरे मन कदा द फ्लोर ऑफ द बकल कैविटी और रोनल कैविटी इज ऑक्युपाइड बै द टंग अन्न अंत the floor the base of the tongue is attached to the buccal cavity or oral cavity so the tongue is attached to
load of buccal cavity by a ligamentous Chat cord frenulum. Okay, so already manam superior frenulum, inferior frenulum gurinchi discuss chess kunamu manam already buckle cavity gurinchi chap kuneta. So, you could e frenulum in TNT. You just observe your tongue is attached to the base of buckle cavity. Here there is a connection that is nothing but frenula or we can say frenulum lingua lingua or Frenulum or lingual frenulum or frenulum linguae. Okay, if three names lo eight chipna kani, that is the ligamentous connection to the floor of buccal cavity okay i hope you understand once i i'm i'm recalling that okay so tongue the floor of buccal cavity or it is a oral cavity it around the nima it is freely movable muscular sensory organ that means so say, muscular means it is made up of skeletal muscle and it is skeletal muscle and nam kabatti mana control on everything that is voluntary and sensory organ and hum, this is responsible for taste that means it has gastrato receptors okay anterior end of tongue is free whereas its posterior end is attached to the hyoid bone the tongue is attached to the floor of buccal cavity by ligamentous structures called frenulum or we can say lingual frenulum or frenulum lingual this ligamentous connection is called frenulum okay let us see the structure The length of the tongue is 10 centimeters. The weight of the tongue is 10. in males it is 70 grams, in females it is 60 grams. Okay, actually our tongue has It is wider at the base and it is narrower at the tip. So this is tip of the tongue and this is the base of the tongue. The tip of the tongue and this is the base of the tongue. The tongue is divided into two portions by an inverted V-shaped furrow called Sulcus terminalis. Okay, it divides the tongue into 
posterior pharyngeal part and anterior oral part okay so this is the anterior oral part and this is the posterior pharyngeal part the posterior pharyngeal part of tongue has irregular folds of lymphoid tissue and this irregular folds of lymphoid tissue is called lingual tonsils lingual tonsils okay lymphoid tissue anagane manam cheppochu dani function ochesi depends okay next the anterior oral part is symmetrically divided into right and left parts by a median sulcus median lingual sulcus this median lingual sulcus it divides the tongue into right and left portions that means the tongue is symmetrically divided into right and left parts by median lingual sulcus okay so what is the length of the tongue that is 10 cm the weight of the tongue is in the case of males it is 70 grams and the females by the ma 60 grams and all okay so tongue structure wise ga chusinatlayite it is divided into two parts and all that is <coughs> posterior pharyngeal part and anterior oral part the posterior pharyngeal part has a lymphoid tissue regular folds of lymphoid tissue called lingual tonsils which are responsible for defense any antigen that enters into our buccal cavity that is destroyed by these lingual tonsils and next this anterior and posterior portions are divided by a furrow called that is sulcus terminalis and septum next comes to this oral part anterior oral part is divided into symmetrical right and left so symmetry ante telusu equal division okay paid body parts ni equal ga divide chese danni symmetry ani cheptunam ikkada form aina equal half ni antimers antaru so here this is right half of the tongue and this is the left half of the tongue it is divided by median lingual sulcus next comes to uh, papillae the upper surface of tongue has small projections called human tongue has four types of papillae that is
circumvalid papillae or simply we can say valid papillae. Fungi form papillae. Freely form papillae. And foliate papillae. So, most of any other kind of papillae, that is, four types: circumvalid or simply we can say valid papillae, fungi form papillae, freely form papillae, and foliate papillae. So, circumvalid papillae. The name itself says that these are circular in shape. Okay. Circumvalid papillae are circular in shape. Okay. Fungi form. Fungi form itself says that these are mushroom shaped okay so freely formed papillae these are conical shape okay foliate papillae these are leaf shaped okay circumvalid papillae are These are larger papillae or largest fungi form. They are uh, a medium sized papillae and filiform, smallest, and these are also medium sized. this these are larger but fewer in number is 8 to 12 papillae present fungi form papillae they are more concentrated and they are ekkuve ikkada untayi ante at the tip and anterior base Filiform papillae in the name of the filiform. Here, circumvalid papillae, fungiform papillae arrange in the middle of the space occupied by this filiform papillae. So, that's what these are numerous and occupied most of the space of the tongue. And foliate papillae, these are also few in number, but these are degenerated at a early childhood so that's what in some books they write and they get books lo choose net later kone books lo maniki human beings lo three types of papillae matra me undai andaru a three types of papillae enti ante circumvalid papillae fungi form papillae and filiform papillae the foliate papillae is absent in humans why because at early childhood early childhood time lo choose net later foliate papillae kuda undai age pege kodi em avutayi ante these are Degenerated. So that's what humans were totally any, any papillae on the end. Only we have three types, not four types of papillae. Is it clear? Okay. Next. So which papillae? So some papillae does not have taste buds. Okay. Let us see diagrammatically it is. Okay. First type is circumvalid papillae, papillae which are arranged inverted V shape. So this is circus terminalis. It separate the tongue into posterior and anterior portions. The name itself says that it is circular. These are circumvalid. Papillae, 
Okay, those are present at the base and they are circular. Equidin name of base they give in time and shape of just a circular shape. And next come to fungiform papillae. Fungiform and the chapamu mushroom shape papillae. More concentrated at the tip. And the anterior much. Okay. Most of the fungiform papillae present at the tip and the anterior margin of the tongue. So, here is the space that is the space that is the space that is the space that is nothing but filiform papillae. So, here we have to make a diagrammatic representation. Most of the space is occupied by the ever occupied by the space. Filiform papillae. Okay. And take it down. Echo number lo a papillae that is filiform papillae. Okay. More concentration when compared to the this circumvalent papillae to compare chest kunte more concentration ever unnaru unte that is fungiform papillae and less concentration ever unte that is circumvalent papillae. Okay. So let us label. This is. Circumvalent, okay, and this is fungi form, and this is fili form, okay, and at the lateral sides, okay, so here some leaf like papilla present. At early childhood, so these are nothing but foliate papillae. Kani tarvati ve mota ento no degenerate type hota hai. So mota many types of papillae hota hai. Only three ma: circumvalent, fungiform, and filiform. Humans lo a type of papillae is absent and na puru foliate papillae ento. But this foliate papillae is present in rabbit. Okay. So let us discuss. So what is the purpose of this papillae? These papillae has some of the papillae has taste buds. Okay, already we have said that the tongue main function is that it is useful for the detection of taste. It has gastrato receptors. Those are nothing but here taste buds. So the taste buds are nothing. Some papillae has taste buds. And no, a region of tongue is nothing. A taste ni detect chest ni ni chudam Dhani batti A taste buds lo papillae ni absent of each other So here So here This is A tongue Okay And this is Sulcus Terminalis Okay, so here the tip of the tongue is responsible for sweet, sweet taste. Okay, the base of the tongue, so that means this complete portion is responsible for Bitter. Okay. The tip of the tongue is responsible for sweet. The base of the tongue is responsible for bitter. And the anterior lateral side is responsible for salty. And 
and the posterior lateral side is responsible for SAR. Okay, so it will be four different tests. Bitter test, sweet test, salty test, sour test. Okay, so let us compare it with the papillae. Okay, so we are having how many types of papillae? Ma? Four different types of papillae. Ma? Dan flow, okay, type A, and D. Um, childhood time लोने degenerate type होते हैं ना बट humans लोने एक वन्टे papillae three types हैं अब एंड एंड टे circumpallid fungiform and filiform let us see the locations and अतिय एक test एंड टे ने एक compare चल circumpallid papillae एक रूम नहीं at the base of the tap एंड टे circumpallid papillae ये test में detect चल तो नहीं अंचल तो ना मिक्रा bitter test that means circumpallid circumpallid papillae के test buds उन्नता तेन टा they present or absent present Circumvalid papillae has taste buds. Let us write. It. Taste buds. Present. Absent. Taste buds are present. So, circumvalid papillae a test ni detect chest to name chapter no micro bitter test. That means circumvalid papillae has taste buds. Yes. Taste buds are present on circumvalid papillae. Okay, ma? Next comes to <coughs> what is the location of fungi form papillae? Fungi form papillae, those are present on lateral sides and anterior tip. So, this anterior tip detects sweet taste and lateral side. It is detects salty taste and sour taste. That means this fungiform papillae has taste buds. Yes. Okay. Next. Foliate papillae, those are also present at the base of the lateral sides. That means this foliate papillae also has taste buds. Foliate ki taste buds unna hi kaani avi adult human being lo absent. Dai chese gurtu pet kondi so many times I am repeating this point. Three types of papillae matra me unna hi enteru. Yes, that statement is correct. Why? Because the adult human has only three types of papillae. The fourth type of papillae, foliate papillae, it is degenerated at early childhood. But it has taste buds. Okay. So, ikra Bitter test is detected by circumvalid papillae. Sweet test is detected by fungiform papillae. Salty test is detected by fungiform papillae. Sour test is detected by fungiform papillae. Okay. Next comes to. In middle way, the taste ni detect chest no no? No. Here we are not detecting any taste. That means taste buds are absent in which papillae? Yes. That is in Filiform papillae. Okay, and they enter just a space in fill chest to the gani. Ikada taste is someone inch net when the elanti taste buds koda undo. I hope you understand about this diagrammatic representation. Okay, human has how many types of papillae? That is nothing but three types. And in these three types, which papillae does not have taste buds means that is nothing but filiform. Circumvalid has taste buds, whereas fungiform also has taste buds, but foliate is also has taste buds. Unnaikani, it is degenerated. Okay, so this type of papillae is de degenerated in adults. Okay, right. Next, let us discuss about the functions of tongue. The main functions say functions of tongue. Okay, already check kuna, gestato receptor end. That means it can receive the sense of taste. Okay. Okay. And again, it is responsible for articulation of speech. You just, you just, uh, Speak the letter L. 
एल अने लटर ने स्पीक अटे ट्रई ची एल एल ओके अलगे टेक् टेक् सो इला कोई लटर्स अंत मन स्पीच चेयरान मन टंग ने हेल्प सो विथट मन टंग ने पाले की टेक वी का स्पीक द लटर एल अंड वी का स्पीक द लटर टेक् लाइक दट सो अलग मन माला रेस्पल स्ट्रक्चर एवर अटे दट टेक् दट ट so that that means it is responsible for articulation of speech okay right so next while doing ingestion so ingestion chesina tarvata manam mana tooth help to food ni masticate chestam ani cheptam alage saliva food ni बयोकेमिकल ऐक्टिविटी द्वारा फूड कांप्लेक्स फूड ने स्मा फूड पार्टिकल कन्वर्ट सो अलग फूड ने स्मा फूड पार्टिकल अगर आ फूड बोल कर्चेदेवर अटे मन नमिल तरह आ फूड सलाइव तो कंबई चेस्टर दट नथिंग बट एवर अंत दट ट फूड मिक्स तरवा मुद्दला फाम अवतनी आ मुद्द ने बोल आोल निंगा दट इट इज रेस्पल फर् फोर्थ फंशन इज स्वाइंग ऑफ फुट और वी कैन से डिग्रेटिश So, degradation of food and swallowing or swallowing of food is also responsible. Uh, is all is also done through the tongue. So, swallowing generally and नकुड़े tongue गने दे चाला use होती है. So, swallowing of food or degradation of food is also takes place through the tongue. Okay, fine. So, taste की use होती है, मात्रा डन की use होती है, food में saliva तो mixture डन की use होती है, अलग के mixture से इंतर वाता बोलस मिंगा की यूज अलगे इक मन लिंगल टर्मसेन अंत टंग इज आलो रेस्पल इन डिफेस डिफे यूज अलगे मन बकर क्या फुड इनकोनी वे जस्ट रोटेटिंग आर् टंग लाइक दिश अं मन टंग यूनिवर्सल टूथ ब्रश अटे एपड़ू मन बकर क्या क्लीन ऐ उदेवर अंत दट नथिंग बट Ever wanted ton, so that means it is also act as universal toothbrush. Okay, I hope you understand. Okay, the functions of ton. Sir, we they call that taste, articulation of speech, mixing of food with saliva. Okay, and swallowing or degradation. and defense and it acts as a universal tooth brush okay so this is a brief explanation about tongue the structure of tongue and different kinds of papillae and taste buds okay let us discuss a few bits for two two or three bits on this tongue The papillae which does not have taste buds. Okay, a papillae lo taste buds unda wo. circumvallate fungi form filiform foliate 
ओके आंसर्स अभी कमेंट बाक्स टेक्स्ट चेयना सो मेर कमेंट बाक्स टेक्स्ट उम्मीद इंट्रस्टिंग एंथूसिजिंग उ सो यू विल फाइंग मै मै लर अच्छे से प्लीज कमेंट कमेंट इन कमेंट बाॉक्स ओके सो इक पैपिले अने ये पैपिले टेस्ट बड्स उकम वाले इंटवा उ बिटर टेस्ट में अंदम कदा फंगी फोम उठाई कदा टिप दर अलग नाचुल सैड आंटीरियर एंड आफ नाचुल सैड्स दूँ अलग सौत् टेस्ट डिटेक्ट फोलिएट को अट्ठाई एट द बेस आफ द टन सो दट वाट द आंसर ईज फिफॉम इट इज सिंपली फिंग द टन नैक्स्ट दैपिले which is present in rabbit but absent in humans is again same option that is प्रसेंट इन राबेट बट एबसेंट इन ह्यूम राबेट ह्यूम सकमेट फंगी फोम फिली फोम और फोलिएट विच वन इज सकम वालेट नैक्स्ट द स्मॉलेस्ट पैपिले इज सकम वालेट फंगी फोम फिली फोम एंड फोलिएट वीट अंटू स्मेस्ट दट इज नथिंग बट फिफोम ओके विच वन ईज लजेस्ट अंड विच वन ईज स्मेस्ट ओके विच पैपिल आर् मोर इन नंबर विच पैपिल आर् मोर इन नंबर दट इज नथिंग बट फिफोम पैपिल आर् मोर इन नंबर नाट हि सो नंबर पाइंट आफ व्यू चूस नाइट दट इज फिफोम पैपिल more in number is filiform okay less in number is circum valid okay so this is about the structure of tongue and पैपिले टेस्ट बर्ड्स अंडापिक वेरी फ्रीक्वेंट अड़गे बिट्स अड़गढ़ की झान्स बिट्स अड़ता ओके ई हॉप यू अंडरस्टा मै लैक्चर ओके इफ यू लाइक दट इफ यू लाइक दिस् वीडियो प्लीज लाइक् शेर अंड सब्सक्रैब मई चानल सपोर्ट मी थैंक यू